video, it's video vlog time. I can't believe it's 31st of July already, which means tomorrow's the 1st of August. Where is 2017 going? I just don't get it. It just feels like yesterday was Christmas. It's just like, as they say, the only you get the faster time goes, which is a bit weird. I think it's partly because you, just, you get better at keeping your mind occupied and doing stuff and everything else. So, anyway, as most of you know, I went down to London on Saturday to do the free ride cycle event in London. Basically, cycle, cycle, sort of about 10 miles of roads in the centre of London, and you get to cycle around and around and around as many times as you want. It's a free event. You basically just turn up and go. Or you can be organising like registered vans and you get a nice yellow present top, bib top, whatever the hell you call it, and then you can get numbers so they take photos of you. But I got both of them, but I just couldn't be bothered wearing them. Mainly because I knew it was going to rain. I put the yellow top on there, I put my rain jacket over the top of it, and I, was, I knew I was going to get hot and sweaty anyhow, so I thought that's not going to be a good idea. But it did rain and I got absolutely soaked, but the thing, thing this time of year, and especially in London, even in the rain, it's pretty hot, so I was. I was I didn't know if I was getting wetter from the rain or from the sweat, but anyway, it, it was great fun, I had so much fun. This is the third one I've been to, I went to the very first one which was the year after the Olympics, so 2013 I would like to say, something like that, and then I went last year obviously in this year, so it's, it's good fun, if you're from London, you have to go to it. But you can just hire a Boris bike and then do, do that, because there's, there's that many Boris bikes in London now, you can easily get a Boris bike for doing it. The event's only once a year, but... I would definitely recommend you do it. It's just, it's just great fun getting to cycle down south of London. You, be, you cycle down the Mall, great fun. You cycle just, just past um, the Queen's House, the Buckingham Palace. That's the one. We went down past Number Ten Down the Street. So I said hello to Shoes of May. If she was there, probably a bit busy. And then you also cycle down the Embankment. I can't remember what, what, what the name of the Embankment is, but basically, you just cycle down next to the Thames. It's the one opposite the London Eye and the opposite side of the Thames. It's great fun. You, and I'll post through a dead in the description. The only downside about it is you obviously got to get from King's Cross to the actual event. Don't get me wrong, the cycle routes in London are getting better and better and better, but the one thing, that they aren't very good, the, their signs aren't particularly that great, but if you don't know London, it's not nice to get around, you could, be a bit, you could do it for a bit more helpful about what, what the roads are, but it's the city of the West End. It's just like, well, I know what the city is, I know what the West End is, but for tourists it's not the helpful. And also, on the way back, I tried following the, the, the signs again, but the problem was, lots of people wanted to cycle and were stuck for the cycle event. And you couldn't go on them, but there was another event on afterwards, professional, so were, you weren't allowed on the roads. So you had to follow the signs, they said to be closed. It's like, where do I go? So, in my opinion, their signs could really do for like more than one route, so you can say like route A, route B, so therefore for one route, so you can then pick up another route, so you don't basically get so far and think, oh, now I'm going to go. And then I thought I followed the sat down from my bike, and that just taking me around and around and around on back into the city. I come off and say, like, so I got, I got it up London eventually, but people get really stressed cycling in London. I must admit, it was a sat and the cycling events was a bit quieter, but I quite enjoy it. It's fun having cars, me, 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 back, you think you get it, and you think, well, they'll slow me down, but that's actually in my way, but it was great fun. As a London, the cycle routes are getting far better now, don't they? But there's that many segregated ones that they didn't used to be, so it, it, it's good. But anyway, I'm going to get going now and finish this cycle off. And as I say, I'll post the route that I did in the description. And of course, please do subscribe to my videos and then you get a little notification if you hit the little bell button that is to watch my video vlogs. This is the last one of the month, so I'm doing quite well. But I said I was going to do at least two to three a month, and I'm definitely doing that. Anyway, I'm definitely your so I'm going to run off now and I'll speak to you all when I do another video blog. Bye!